On second and 15, Jones with a screen pass. And room for John U. Smith to run. First down and more as Eccles shoves him out of bounds. So John U. Smith, a big part of this opening drive, a 28-yard pickup. And you can hear the Patriot fans in the stands their excitement because during the offseason when they signed Hunter Henry from the Los Angeles Chargers and they signed John U. Smith from the Tennessee Titans, they said, we're getting two All-Pros. Third and one. And Jones trying to do it himself, he does. In the parking lot, no, he's not bad, no, J.B. In, in high school. In high school, as a quarterback. Screen to Harris. <laughs> J.J. Taylor in it running back, and it's a play-action pass. Jones with a flag down. Completes it to Johnu Smith again. First time Taylor has played since fumbling against Tampa Bay. It's a screen pass to Taylor. Runs into his own man, stays on his feet for New England, and 13 of them have come in Jets territory. Over the middle, it's Bourne at the 25. Good separation skills. Jones over the middle. It is caught for a first down. Jacoby Myers moves the chains. Ashton Davis on the tackle after a 19-yard pickup. You know, we showed those tight ends in the in the uh, feature, and you really think about the slot receivers, kind of starting with Troy Brown. You've got a huge advantage. Play action. Jones comes back the other way. There is Johnson, the linebacker. Jones chased out. He can run for the first down. He will. Mac Jones. And they fake the handoff to Myers. Screen to Bolden. He's got the catch. He's got momentum. And Bolden has a touchdown. Brandon Bolden for six. His first touchdown of the season, a 12-play drive, and New England answers after the Jets score. You get attracted to the shiny object, which was Jacoby Myers going from left to right, and then that shiny object takes your eyes there, and then you get the screen coming back in the opposite direction. <laughs> Jets would have had much to gain there from the field goal, but they come up empty. Bolden on the screen, just scored on the screen, and he's got another big play here. Jones throws right, it is caught. Here, fourth and one here. They are going for it. Jones, he's got the first down to Myers. That is just the fourth time this year the Patriots have gone for it on fourth down, and they're now three out of four. You know, you have fourth down plays, you have also when you have fourth and two, you have two point plays. So some of those two point plays that you'd run down to get a two point conversion, you can substitute them in right here. Tells Josh McDaniels if he feels like they're in four down territory as Myers has another catch. 102 to go, they flip it to Bolden around the right side and escorted out by the center. And sometimes you fumble that. Jones, Bolden has been busy down the sideline. He's got a first down. Myers is the motion man. Jones to Bolden at the five, and he's brought down right there. At Jones to the end zone, and it is juggled and caught for his touchdown. Hunter Henry. And he now has a touchdown in four consecutive games. The first Patriots tight end to do that since Rob Gronkowski back in 2013. Boy, tight ends are normally bigger people. They have huge mitts. These things are like oven mitts, and Hunter Henry has soft oven mitts. And that ability to catch that ball. To the Jets locker room. On first down, Jones is looking to throw. And he gets rid of it, connecting with Bourne. He took one 75 a week ago. Third down and three. High snap. Jones gets rid of it to Bolden, uncovered again, and a first down and more. Bolden shoved out by Marcus May. But, James, how many times have we seen Bolden wide open today? Well, we've seen Bolden, but it's been really impressive, the creativity of Josh McDaniel. And why do I mention that? 
because he started this game really thinking about 12 personnel, which means one back, two tight ends. John o. Smith goes down early. Now he has to kind of pivot a little bit, and you're seeing some 11 personnel. Bolden has tied a career high with six catches today. Jones looking at the air, checks it down to Harris, and it's Phillips on the play. Yeah, and I think it's a great play. As I looked at the replays, it appeared the ball remained off of the ground by, by about an inch, and I think it's a good ruling of an interception. Kobe Meyer said, I cannot <laughs> believe that he does that. He's running it here, and then he's down at the 47. Jones, and he hits Myers. Myers wrapped up by Ashton Davis. I think that's the way these guys feel. Jones has a wide open Henry at the 10, cuts it up at the 5 and down at the 3. Marcus May on the tackle, a 22-yard gain. Well, late in the third quarter, you're pounding the ball, you're rushing. Damian Harris has over 100 yards. Little play action fake to him. Get Hunter Henry on a corner. Thought he saw him as a right tackle here. Did not play well in the preseason at right tackle as Jones completes that pass to Myers. They move the light back. Jones looking deep down the field for Bourne. He's got him. Bourne inside the five. Bourne thought he may have gotten in, but they mark him down at the one. And with that completion, Mac Jones goes over 300 yards passing for the first time in his career. And when we're in meetings and when you study Mac Jones, where has he been effective? In between the numbers, in the middle of the field. The deep balls, you haven't seen a lot of those. And here is a just a classic go route and nine.